What's up everybody, my name is Luke from Archer Woods, pre owned menswear and vintage watch store. I have a few different variations of suits with colours and textures and materials uh, in my wardrobe. But one thing I haven't got, and one thing I've been really trying to find recently, is a brown winter suit. So something maybe corduroy or just a heavier sort of uh, wool flannel and i'm not quite finding the right one yet i do i buy pre-owned so it's a little bit harder than just going to your tailors or a store and buying one but i just want to get the right one it's actually an underrated color for a suit it can lend itself to smart casual wear i just wanted to make this video today to show off 10 different kind of styles and ideas of brown suits and uh yeah these are the sort of suits that i've kind of come across in my sort of research and what i'm going to be looking for so first up is this double breasted what looks like a cotton uh, brown suit here, this guy. I really like this, it's soft shoulders, peak lapels, super casual. He's wearing it with like, I think a black t-shirt. Um, he's got the sleeves altered, so they're relatively high. So there's a lot of, it's, it's a pretty casual suit. I mean, this would look great with loafers, um, but it would also look great with like a white shirt underneath. You can definitely uh, formal it up a bit. So next up is this, um, what looks like a corduroy number, a uh, bit of a lighter brown, but this guy has uh, paired it really well with like a denim shirt, a brown green and beige tie and a pocket square. And um, yeah, I mean, it's, a, it's again, it looks like a really rugged suit. Corduroy is one of my favorite materials. Uh, looks super comfortable, soft shoulders, a lot of volume in there as well. So it just looks like you can move around in it and live in it. So it's, it looks like a, a, a really lovely suit. Um, I don't know what brand it is, but you know, I wouldn't be surprised if it's something like Ring Jacket or Drake's or something like that. But yeah, it just shows you can even wear a tie and a pocket chief, uh, and it still doesn't look too over the top. So oh yeah, I really like that. The next up is this really dark chocolate brown uh, suit. Can't really see too close, but it's got this kind of velvety texture to it. It may even be like a micro cord. Um, simple white shirt, um, some loafers, and a, and a white pocket square. Just really simple, really elegant, but the brown colour just adds a, something wearable in the daytime. And I think a common theme here is softer shoulders, more looser fabrics, and um, yeah, it's, it's a great look. Okay, next up is this, uh, just the blazer. So I'm a big fan of um, splitting up suits and it just shows with brown, you can do it to a really good effect here. It's a very strong shouldered one, very structured, something along the lines of like a husband's Paris. Uh, or even it may possibly even a vintage one itself and it's been tailored tweaked a little bit paired it here with some high-waisted black or navy trousers can't really see from here some cuban heels and a david bowie banty um and yeah just a really interesting look something you don't see too often even with a banty it doesn't diminish from it at all and it's a very smart smart look and a lovely belt as well and i think a cartier tank as well next we have this really relaxed brown suit with a brown roll neck um i think it's got this kind of check pattern to it like a mini check pattern to it again soft flowy material looks really comfortable but also the brown and brown works really well together so not every color clashes the same and this you could just show is like a dark brown or a lighter brown work well together as well as with different patterns so yeah it's really nice look okay here we've got a bit more of a formal look to it a double breasted very large peak lapel suit with a blue striped shirt navy tie very classic very italian and this guy just looks fantastic he's got a pocket chief a sort of similar color to his shirt i can't really see from here you can see the shirt cuffs popping up um outside the sleeve and yes yeah, this is the sort of thing you see in italy in that in pity or something like that very elegant, very cool, but also just different. And it's not your it's not your everyday older gent wearing this sort of stuff. But it's definitely the goal. So next up, my man, Yasuto Kamishita here. Statement piece of a tie, very narrow at the tip, going to quite large. Um, it's got a bit of a 50s feel about it, this, this whole look. Uh, tassel loafers and a striped uh, red and white shirt. I can't really see from here, but very cool look again soft shoulders um no break in the trousers and the, they look like they're quite high-waisted uh it's very cool and the tie works really, really well so again with the browns it mixes up with all different sort of colors it, it sort of it just elevates any sort of other colors that you pair it with reds and blues and all sorts so it just really works well 
And that's essentially earth colors in general. So I'm a big fan of them. This looks, sorry about the photo quality here. Uh, I lifted this from a uh, YouTube video. So Unknown Vlogs, um, you've probably heard of him. He's kind of a big uh, YouTuber. He was like one of the starters of that sort of like, what are you wearing, taking a camera around, uh, asking people what they're wearing sort of thing. Um, he did one outside the Drake sale uh, or like a sample sale place. And this guy who I believe worked for Huntsman as a cutter, I, I can't really remember too well. I just had to screen grab it and put it in my Pinterest board because I just, the cut of this suit is unbelievable. Uh, as you'd expect from, from him. Um, the dark, dark brown really works well with this sort of purple striped shirt. We're seeing a very common trend with these, um, where the striped shirt works really well and a, and, a, and a statement tie also. So there is a formula that can work really well with a brown suit. Um, this is just fantastic. I just love this suit and if I can afford one one day, we're heading to Huntsman. Yasuto Kamishita again, I had to put him in twice because he's the GOAT. Um, same suit, I believe, and just with a striped t-shirt, little pocket square, and just completely different look. So you had the tie on before and the shirt, and this time horizontal, just striped t-shirt, looks smart casual, and, and a completely different sort of vibe to it. Love it, absolutely love it, he's a master. And lastly, uh, another corduroy one, but this is a little bit more reserved, just very simple lapels, uh, a gorgeous, burnt orange roll neck that looks really soft really easy some oxfords and just a slither of a pocket square just really cool really elegant really casual you can wear that absolutely anywhere and just look great there's not there's no way you couldn't wear this um, and not fit in um, right up my street the colors there i love the color of the roll neck love the color of the suit um, and yeah, this is the sort of thing I'll be looking for. And so in terms of, um, so I don't know what brand it is, um, but this, I have a cord suit from Officine General, which has a very similar sort of feel and fit to it. Um, so it'd be something like that, but yeah, really beautiful. So that's my top 10 brown suit fits, the things that I've been looking for, sort of inspiration, trying to get an idea of the kind of suit that I'm looking for. Shout out in comments if you know of any brands that I should be looking out for. Um, in my head I'm thinking always Drake's, uh, Officine General, uh, Spire and McKay, I don't know if I said it, Spear and McKay, I, can't, I, I don't really know what it is, but yeah, um, let us know in the comments below. Check out Archer and Woods, our store for pre-owned menswear and vintage watches. Uh, like and subscribe. Um, we showcase our items in videos and give exclusive YouTube discounts. Uh, so be sure to check them out. And uh, yeah, any questions, let us know. It's hello at archimus.co.uk. Look forward to hearing from you. Cheers.